Hey guys, how you doing? Steve Lavia. I just figured I'd do a little video on this Confederate flag thing and what I think about it. And, uh, you know, I'm a Yankee. I'm from the North. So I don't really know too much about the Confederate flag. But, you know, I think that these clowns are trying to erase history by removing flags. And uh, I don't think it's a symbol of racism. I really don't. No, I'm from the North. And... Um, I'm not racist at all. I don't care, you know, if you're blue, purple, green, if you're an alien. What do I care? As long as you're a decent person and, you, you know, um, you, you do your part for society, who am I to judge anybody? I don't, I'm not racist at all. That's one thing about me is I'm not. I, I don't care. But I don't think that it's um, actually the flag that they're, they're talking about. That, that's, that's a war flag. Uh, they had other flags that were involved in the Civil War. There was there was different there's different flags, and that's just one of them that you know that they use. But it, it's a part of history. How can you guys erase history? You know they're down here talking about taking statues down and stuff. Cause one idiot, one ra one one racist idiot from down south went in and killed a bunch of black people in the church. That was bad. But you can't condemn everybody for one one idiot and try to erase history. I think that's the most asinine thing I've heard in a long time. That they're trying to, you know, ban the flag and this and that because of one one act of one idiot. Now taking down taking down the flag and banning the flag. I'm sure there's racism, you know, there's racism all over the place. But that's not going to stop racism. You know, taking the flag down, banning banning a, a symbol of, um, you know, historical symbol. They were talking about digging up some uh, general's bones and moving them. Like, are you ridiculous? I think you, the bloody country's stuck on stupid. Really, I do. Ridiculous. Ridiculous. I think that they should keep history. I don't think that they should erase history. I think that it's, you know, the North and the South had good and bad in, 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 the, in the whole thing, the Civil War. A lot of people died in the Civil War. You know? A lot of people. Big, big numbers of people that died. And you just can't erase history like that. Being, the, being a historical flag, let the people from the South fly the flag. Who cares? You know, a lot of people are proud to be from the South. You know, I got a lot of friends from the South. And uh, they should be proud of their heritage. You know, even though they lost the war, they should still be proud. Or whatever. <laughs> but anyway, um, I think it's I think it's a crazy thing, really. I sit back and watch and I just shake my head with all the stuff that's going on. Completely asinine. I think the people from the South should, should stand up and fight for their rights. They're taking our rights away left and right to begin with. You know, you can't even you can't even uh, fly a flag, a historical flag. Half them people down here flying a the flag, they're probably not racist. They're just proud of their, their heritage. That's where they're from. They're, they're from the South. They want to fly that flag, you know. It's a battle flag. It's a battle flag, I believe, from Tennessee or something. But I did a little bit of, I looked up a couple of the different flags. There was quite a few different flags they had, you know, back in the day. And that's just one kind of one that, you know, revolved as a symbol of, um, you know, um, the southern the southerners and stuff. And uh, nothing wrong with it. That's just my opinion. I got the right to my opinion. And uh, I think the politicians sometimes need to pull their head out of their ass, you know, and ask the people what they think. Look at the surveys. You know, 75% of the people say you shouldn't remove the flag, or like 25% say you should. So that's kind of a no-brainer. Oh, no, i got to be politically correct. You can't say the wrong thing. You can't say this. You can't say that. You know? You have to pull your Adam's apple out and cut your balls off, and then all of a sudden you're a superhero. Turn yourself into a woman, you'll be a superhero. It's like this flipping country's lost their lost their brains, lost their lost their flipping way. Crazy, but what do I know? <laughs> oh man, another another video from Stevie Lau speaking his mind. <laughs> <laughs> you know, and you people from the South need to stand up for your rights. And don't listen to some of these idiots like Al Not Too Shopton and, uh, you know, some of these, these guys. Some of these guys are the worst bigots going, you know? Uh, just squirm themselves out of Obama's ass. 
you know, a couple of weeks ago. It's like, I don't know. I listen to some of these guys that just shake my head. Stand up for your rights. You're Americans. You've got the right to fly the, fly the flag. That's what I think. I think that, um, you know, they're taking too many of our rights away. And uh, stand your ground. That's what I say. That's just my opinion. Well, what do I know? I'm just a working guy. And I think that we need to stand up for our her heritage. Good or bad, it's still, her it's still our heritage. It's been there for, you know, hundreds and hundreds of years. Can't erase it. You never can erase it. Ridiculous. But anyway, that's my thoughts. What do I know? Have a good day.